we want to take a look at the square of a binomial sum and a binomial difference. And so as you notice, these two look the same, except the middle term, if it's a positive, it's going to be a positive. If it's a negative, it's going to be a negative. Um, you can kind of think of it in a little bit shortcut way. When I look at the first one, I'm going to square the first term. So I'm going to have x squared squared. And then I'm going to multiply the inside. So I'm going to have 5x squared, and I'm going to multiply by 2. So 2 times 5x squared. And then I'm going to have 5 squared. And I'm going to simplify that, so I get x to the fourth plus 10x squared plus 25. Again, if you don't want to memorize that formula and you want to write this twice and you want to use FOIL, you may do that. It's just that this will take much less time. Now over here is the same thing. Why don't you pause the video, come back, and see if you got the right answer. So we're going to do x squared minus 2 times, I've got 7x, plus 7 squared. So I'm going to get x squared minus 14x plus 49. Did you get it right? Hope so.